Hello, this is AJ. Welcome to the Point of View Stories for Adventure. Let's begin. For the last five years, Michelle has hated her job. She has really hated her job for the last five years. Why? Well, because for the last five years, her workload has been much too heavy. She has had a very heavy workload for the last five years. Now, she has made a lot of money. For the last five years, she's made tons of money, a huge amount of money. She has been a vice president of IBM for the last five years. So five years ago, she got this job, vice president. Since five years ago, for the last five years, she has been a vice president at IBM. During that time, she has made a lot of money every year. In fact, for the last five years, she has had a lot of cash flow, very strong, positive cash flow. She's had great cash flow during that time. But unfortunately, Michelle has been miserable. She has been totally, completely miserable at her job. She has been miserable because she's been stressed. She's been so stressed. And the stress has built and it has built and it has built. Until finally one day, she had a meltdown. A total, complete meltdown. She screamed at her boss. She said, I have too much work. I hate this damn job. I hate it. I hate it. I hate it. I hate it. Whew. She had a total meltdown. In fact, she screamed at her boss for five hours without stopping. It was a total meltdown. She lost all control of her emotions. And finally, after five hours of screaming, <sighs> She stopped. Her boss was kind of angry, actually. And he said, well, no problem. We'll just automate your job. And he did. He automated Michelle's job. Michelle was replaced by a computer. But she was very happy because she moved to Thailand and she lived on a beach. And every day she felt relaxed and happy. Okay, that's the end of our first story. And you'll notice again, there was a change. By now, you should understand and you should know why the change happened. Just listen to it. Just See it, understand the meaning, and do not think about grammar terms. For God's sakes, please don't do that. Let's go to the next story, into the future. In the future, there will be a woman named Michelle. Michelle is going to hate her job because her workload will be much too heavy. She'll have too much work. Yes, she's going to make a lot of money. Her job is going to be vice president at IBM. She'll be a vice president at IBM. And she's going to have great positive cash flow. Lots of money coming to her into her bank account. But the problem is going to be that she will be miserable. She's going to be totally miserable because of her job. She's going to have so much stress in her life. And finally, one day, she'll have a meltdown. She'll scream at her boss, Ah! I have too much work! I hate this job! I hate it! I hate it! I hate it! I hate it! She'll scream and she'll scream and she'll scream for five hours. And finally, after five hours, she'll stop. <sighs> now her boss... He'll be a little angry. And he'll say, well, no problem. We'll automate your job. 
And he will. He's gonna automate her job. Michelle will be replaced by a computer. But it's okay because she's gonna be super happy. She'll move to Thailand. She'll live on a beach. And she'll feel relaxed and happy every day. Okay, that is the end of the point of view stories, the POV lesson for adventure. I will see you next time. Bye-bye.